today for the Bitcoin price. And yes, guys, I am selling all my Bitcoin. If Bitcoin does this one specific thing, and of course, it sounds crazy. I don't want to over dramatize things here, but I feel obligated to talk about these scenarios. I feel obligated to talk about my thoughts on Bitcoin right now, because as you remember, in the last few days, I was getting severely, severely cautious talking about one specific scenario unfolding. People were still laughing at me when we were at 56, 57,000 US dollars. We broke down and now this actually looks like a legit scenario. Are we going bearish? Are we going bullish? Are we going to see a dump uh, bounce very soon? And of course, what has ever happened to my trades? How will I play the future situation for Bitcoin? And I can tell you, I have my legendary trade, my next legendary trade. You were waiting for it. I have it planned out right now. And I want to tell you exactly in that video when I am going to open it. So make sure you watch this video until the very, very end. You smash up the like button to a new all-time high. You leave your thoughts in the comment section down below and you just make noise for the algorithm if you appreciate these content uh, updates here on the sidelines i am here in a beach in dubai actually sitting in with some friends but of course this doesn't hold me back to uh, make these very important urgent videos on the sidelines as well so smash up the like button and let's go straight into the content and I talked about this very, very horrifying scenario actually unfolding for Bitcoin, which is called the Wyckoff Accumulation Schematic. And as you can see, we have left on the left hand side phase A, B, C, and in phase D at 57,000 or so, I talked about a potential dump for Bitcoin here down to the support lines. And well, here in phase D, we are on our way down. And now the question is hey, is Bitcoin going to break it? Are we going to go even lower? This is what I want to talk about right now. Let me quickly go here into the charts and what we can see here is the daily candles for Bitcoin. And we broke uh, down from this rising wedge actually. Something I told you, when we break this specific level, this is the moment I am ringing all. I am ringing all my alarm bells here. And I rang the alarm bells for you guys. And as you can see, we were forming this um, symmetrical triangle. We also broke down from that. My next alarm bell were ringing and eventually the, the 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 craziest alarm bells are actually ringing right now that we are breaking this level here this level on the daily on the weekly considered to be our previous low for bitcoin we are breaking it bitcoin is creating a new lower low and this is the beginning of a potential bear trend am i saying we are i, I mean come on guys i want to i want to get it straight here for maybe some people who misunderstand that am i saying that no when I get it too windy that Bitcoin is going bearish the bull run is over no not necessarily but the likelihood furthermore significantly increases that we might be seeing some more downwards and sideways action for Bitcoin this is why once Bitcoin broke below this rising wedge I took millions of US dollars out of my trades right I did that for a very specific reason and now I closed actually I closed or I got closed many other trades as well for hedging my my positions i am taking these profits in bitcoin i showed you earlier my biggest position on by femax was closed at more than 20 bitcoin in profits of course i paid significant funding fees as well of course full disclosure here but i took many many bitcoins and profits here to make sure that i am not a victim of a potential scenario unfolding here we as sophisticated traders we are even lo either longing or waiting for bitcoin i am not shorting bitcoin in a bear market so now the question is how low will bitcoin go and what is eventually my line in the sand where I'm going to sell all my Bitcoin? Here, quick disclaimer. I will never sell all my Bitcoin, not my hodling portfolio. I'm only selling my positions. I'm only selling my Bitcoin in positions, taking profits into my long-term hodling portfolio. And this level here, the 43,000 US dollar actually perfectly, perfectly coincides. Let me quickly go over here. I want to show it to you. It coincides absolutely perfectly with the 21 week EMA and here dear ladies and gentlemen the 21 week EMA this is the line in the sand this is the distinction between bull market and bear market and to show you the severity of this actual distinction here let me go back into the last bull market let me uh, um, let me put the logarithmic scale on and show you actually how crazy important this is if i am going into the last bull market you can see that every single time the markets were overextended every single time we had a lot of fear and greed uh, fear, fear, uh, greed in the market 
the market went down and touched and basically kissed this orange line here, the 21 week EMA. The 21 week EMA, once it was broken, the very first time, this was the start of the severe trend towards the downside. This was the start of a severe bear market here for Bitcoin, which actually lasted much longer than everyone wanted to. So now, finding ourselves in 2020 the bull market the first time and i was telling you back then when we went down from 12,500 us dollars to 9,600 us dollars guys don't freak out as long as the 21 week ema is not broken i don't consider this a bear market and we touched it we kissed it just exactly like in the last bull market and we got a strong bounce towards the upside ever since then i was waiting cautiously i was waiting for finally bitcoin going down and kissing it once again we never came even close to it and right now let me put on the linear scale again right now you can see bitcoin is maybe maybe only maybe here going on the way down to the 43,000 us dollar area which is in alignment with this massive massive linear uh, uh, long horizon horizontal support here the target of the rising wedge actually for bitcoin so if bitcoin dips below that i will be out of all of my trades even from the trades which i opened at nine thousand us dollars i will be out of all of them just to wait and just to make sure that i'm not getting trapped here and remember guys i'm not realizing any losses for that sake i'm just realizing profits for that sake and this is very important to mention because well why should you sell bitcoin like i'm, I'm not selling my holding portfolio it's getting very dark why should you sell bitcoin at a lower price if you could have sold it at sixty? I mean my holding portfolio I will never ever touch it don't get me wrong here I will never touch my holding portfolio but my trading portfolio my short-term portfolio of course this I will touch of course there I have to hedge my positions and of course there I want to make sure that I'm always going home with profits once I am in profits by the way in the pinned comment down below you get 2520 US dollars as free bonus if you go into the pinned comment the very first comment of the in the comment section you get uh, after clicking the link I will use the buy I, I use my buy the buy bit the most I use also Femex you get on Bybit 1610 US dollars for free. Go to the pin comment, click the link of Bybit if you're not subscribed yet, then put in your email address, your password after like 15 seconds or so you get your own account and after your initial deposit you get 1610 us dollars completely for free you can trade with the free bonus you can long and short and this is the nicest thing you can withdraw the profits from this free trade as well from the exchange also guys let me quickly go over i want to show you my trade because there is still one trade left there's one sheriff in town this is my trade here over on bybit 1.13 million us dollars in contract size and there you can see my unrealized profits approximately with six 6.7 bitcoin this one why do i have this one open look at my entry price look at my liquidation price my liquidation price is at 38,000 us dollars and well i'm personally banking i'm personally betting myself on the narrative of a bull market i am personally banking on bitcoin being in a bull market and this is only legitimized when we are going below the 21 week ema when we are going below the 43,000 us dollar levels unless we are not going below I'm in the stance of a bull market and this is why I'm having this one trade, the last soldier for the bulls. This one is open because you know, I always want to have one trade which I can hold until the new all-time high, until the eventual all-time high of this bull market. And of course, many people are asking me, Chris, what is your next legendary trade? I am here for you. Let me quickly elaborate on that. My next legendary trade, I will open exactly at this weight, exactly at this level at the 40 i am placing today or tomorrow just in case we go down at the 43000 us dollar levels a little bit above we take profits before the price target we put the limit orders above the specific target i will take a, i will put a limit order very important a limit order above the 43000 us dollar levels a very very big one of course with a stop loss in case we are closing below the um, the ema I mean, if I see here signs of a bounce, I go immediately in with a huge, huge position. If I go in, it turns out that, that this is not a bull market. Well, then I might be wrong. I might be, uh, th th then I might scale out again. But personally, I, I am personally banking on the narrative of a bull market. And I would trade this bounce here towards the upside. Pro potentially, we are maybe forming some W or so on the daily or on the four hourly. I, I really hope we are not going that low. But if we go 
this will be my insane insane new legendary trade and just to show you potentially what kind of discount you can get on that if you are counting from the all-time high all the way down to the 21 ema this is a 32 percent discount on your bitcoin right and just imagine we can catch the, uh, the 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 retracement low here just imagine we can enter a massive massive long position here at the 21 week ema i mean how beautiful would that be right of course guys hedge your bets and um you should always have the vast majority of your portfolio in a long-term holding portfolio i'm saying that day in and day out but um yeah this, this is just what i'm planning right now let me know your thoughts let me know what you think about it and with that being said we will see each other very soon in the next one of Venom crypto and as always guys as always bye bye <laughs>